Hello everybody, I'm BC Begley and these are your news headlines for January the 17th of 2023. Russia to boost troops in the West, expanding its army to one and a half million people. Russia will create new commands near Europe as it expands its military to 1.5 million people amid deepening tensions with the United States and its allies over the Kremlin's invasion of Ukraine. At Davos, the mood is somber as many CEOs question the economic outlook. The end of the free money era has put a chill in the Swiss mountain air. Business leaders and economists gathered here this week for the World Economic Forum's annual event say they see a world buffeted by high interest rates that central banks have pushed through to combat inflation. This has created a threat of recession and led some of the world's Biggest companies to hold their breath and their spending ahead of an uncertain year. The worry in Davos this year, globalization is under siege. This year's World Economic Forum's theme, a planet of appeal to find, quote, cooperation in a fragmented world, seems more possessed by the ruptures that have already taken place. In a press call with reporters last week, World Economic Forum President Borge Rinde said the meeting, quote, will happen against the most complex geopolitical and geoeconomic backdrop in decades. President Joe Biden's big government is getting even bigger and reaching further into Americans' lives. United States President Joe Biden is on track to expand the size and authority of the federal government to levels unseen since the height of former President. President Obama's administration. Former Wagner commander flees to Norway and seeks asylum. A former commander in Russia's Wagner private military company has fled to Norway and is seeking asylum after crossing that country's Arctic border, according to Norwegian police and a Russian activist. Six people, including a baby, were killed in a cartel-style execution, California Sheriff's Office says. At least six people, including a mother and her six-month-old baby, are dead after an early morning massacre Monday that authorities in Goshen, California said may be related to cartel activity. Scientists unearthed mega-raptors and feathered dinosaur fossils in Chile's Panagonia. Scientists in Chile's Panagonia region are unearthing the southernmost dinosaur fossils recorded outside Antarctica including remains of mega-raptors that would have dominated the area's food chain before their mass extinction. NASA already unveiled a successor to the James Webb telescope that will search for life on alien planets. The James Webb Space Telescope has only been active for six months. However, NASA is already planning a successor to the multi-billion dollar observatory. The Habitable Worlds Observatory won't be the first telescope that NASA launches after Webb, as the Nancy Grace Roman Observatory is already set for a 2027 launch. Still, it will continue NASA's mission to find life on alien planets. Hundreds of London police officers are expected to be fired over domestic and sexual abuse offenses, according to a report. So hundreds of police officers in London are expected to be fired following investigations into sexual and domestic abuse offenses, the head of the Metropolitan Police reportedly said on Tuesday, a day after one officer admitted to the rape and sexual assaults of a dozen women over a 17-year period. Top United States General visits training site for Ukrainian soldiers. This is not a run-of-a-mill rotation. United States Army General Mark Milley, chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff, said Monday afternoon as he met with his commanders, quote, this is one of those moments in time where you want to make a difference. This is it. Milley, who visited the sprawling Grafenor training area to get his first look at the new so-called combined arms instruction, has said it will better be prepared Ukrainian troops to launch an offensive or to counter any surge in Russian attacks. 
And guys, those are your news headlines. As always, all of the articles I have covered, I will put links uh, to those articles in the video's description below. Don't forget to stop by and visit the website at bcbegley.com. Also, you can like and subscribe, and you can comment on the video below. And I will see everybody on the next video.